many places struggle with containing stray animals. But lately, animal control officers in Taiwan have struggled more than most. Several times a day, they're called to trap and capture abandoned cats and dogs. Animal rights groups estimate some two million are roaming wild. The island has only a few public shelters, and they're overcrowded. The government says that leaves it with little choice, but to put down the animals they catch. Over the past ten years, more than a million strays have been euthanized. That has led to recent violent confrontations between police and animal rights groups. Even celebrities like Taiwan's rapper Dog G have waded in with music videos, demanding the government end what he calls sanctioned cruelty. Animals don't have a vote, but we, the public, do, and we've said to officials, if they keep arguing that killing animals is right, they will lose our vote. Young Xiang is so opposed to animal euthanasia, she built her own shelter. She spent her life savings taking care of more than a thousand cats and dogs. Sometimes I worry about how I'm going to survive in the future, but when I'm here, I'm happy. The animals live one day, I live one day. The sheer number of animals here is incredible. It does give us a sense of the magnitude of the problem. People like Ms. Young and others have, over the years, forced the government to improve its policies in terms of the treatment of stray animals, but many still feel those policies are not humane enough. Activists say the government should either neuter animals and set them free, or encourage more people to adopt. The government admits there are shortcomings, but says it is addressing concerns. In 1999, for example, we were euthanizing 90% of all animals we caught. Last year, we were down to 50%. I would say we have made remarkable progress. Government officials have extended the number of days they keep animals alive from 7 to 12, but say the public and a throwaway culture are ultimately to blame, abandoning pets and leaving them to be dealt with by an overwhelmed system. Steve Chow, Al Jazeera, Taoyuan, Taiwan.